long-awaited rules to govern public and commercial activities on Mauna Kea have been postponed again. Always Investigating was first to report the University of Hawaii Regents delayed into mid-August what was supposed to have been a mid-July vote on draft regulations. Well, today, UH said it's pushing decision-making off again until August 30th. UH was granted the authority more than a decade ago to regulate activities for cultural and natural resource protection, as well as public health and safety. Statewide public hearings were held beginning last fall to develop the framework. UH says the draft rules will be posted at least six days prior to the August 30th meeting, and members of the public will have the opportunity to provide written and oral in-person testimony. Also today, a federal judge remanded to state court a lawsuit filed challenging inter-island county police authority after Maui and Honolulu officers were deployed to Mauna Kea and have since returned. And in a separate lawsuit aiming to strike the governor's emergency proclamation, a hearing will be held Tuesday on whether the governor himself has to testify in person at preliminary injunction hearings later in the week. Cultural practitioner Paul Nevis, meanwhile, has a court-ordered TRO allowing him solo access up and down the mountain. The court today filed a clarification of the order which requires the state to give him ample advance notice if a construction convoy is coming.